Hello, my name is Aiden, and this is my account with no shame. And today, we are going to be exploring 100%. They debuted on September 18th, 2012 under T.O.P. Media. The group currently consists of four members. This is Rockhyun. Oh, look at that. There's just, there's a bunch of rocks. He's just playing with rocks, and he's Rockhyun. That works out quite well. He's main vocalist. His nicknames are Rocky and Rockchan. His hobbies are shopping, listening to music, watching movies, and cartoons. He participated in the unit and ranked 14th. His ideal type is someone cute with long hair who is well organized and clean. Now we've got Jongwon, who's just, he's living in the breeze. He's a vocalist. His nicknames are Jong and Jonari. His hobbies are composing songs and choreographing. People who can choreograph, it's always so impressive to me because I wouldn't even know where to begin. His ideal type is someone sensible and cute with lots of egg and kind hearted. This is Chan Yong, chilling over by the tree. And oh, there's actually a swing on that tree. That's cool. I like it. Very aesthetic. He's main rapper and vocalist. His nicknames are Yong Yong, Chan Yongi, and Chan Yonsei. <laughs> As in like Beyonce? His hobbies are watching movies, listening to music, and shopping. His ideal type is someone cute, understanding, and very considerate. Haven't every single one of them specified cute? Yeah. This is Hyukjin. He's lead vocalist, lead dancer, and magne. His nicknames are Piggy and Hyukjini. His hobby is watching TV. He also participated in the unit and ranked 35th. Hyukjin's ideal type is someone who is pretty when smiling. So this is Minwoo. He actually passed away earlier this year. His role was leader, vocalist, and lead dancer. This is Sanghun, a former member who was vocalist, visual, and face of the group, and Mangne. His nicknames are Sanghuni, Little Princess, and Giant Baby. I feel like I've heard some other idol with the nickname Giant Baby. It might have been someone from Sonamu. I don't know, but that's just really interesting that that's come up twice now. This is Changbum. He was main dancer, lead rapper, and vocalist. His nicknames are Bummy and Changbummy. His hobbies are watching movies, writing songs, and playing the drums. Right now, he's currently a member of Vermuda. So now we're going to listen to three of their music videos. This first one is their debut, which I've never heard before, and it is called Bad Boy. That was an interesting sound it made. Yeah. They've got some cool aesthetics going on here. I like the harmonies in the vocals already. Okay. This is kind of familiar. I may have heard this in the past not knowing what it was. Ooh, this is very familiar. If I heard this, it was like over a year ago. Possibly... Not likely more than two years, but it's been a while. The music video is not familiar, though. I really like this sound, honestly. I actually have not heard a whole lot from this group, but what I have heard I've, I've really enjoyed. I like the vocals. Like, at this part. Sounds good. Actually, vocals at pretty much every point just sound really good. A talented group. This is a good rap, actually. 
Very uh, passionate. You can you can really see the passion in their expressions and their voices too. Well, you can hear it in their voices. <laughs> Rather sit down, but thanks. Nice. That was good. I'm adding it to my playlist. This next song is called Beat or Shimjangi Twinda in uh, Korean. I've heard this one. This is probably my favorite song of theirs, but I've never actually, you know, analyzed the instrumental and the vocals. I just know that I enjoy it. I actually haven't seen the, uh, music video in a long time. They've got a really dark aesthetic in this. Yeah, this whole song is, uh, Heart themed. I'm gonna turn this up. I just love this song so much. It's just, it's very dramatic. I like the way that the synth kind of just goes up and down, like, throughout the chorus. So their names are on, like, those, uh, coffins, I guess. <laughs> Some good uh, choreographical skills going on. Yeah, I don't like the way she's walking around with those like pliers or whatever. <laughs> Interesting. So they keep switching between really bright sets and dark sets. I think they're like trying to differentiate between how things seem and how things are. I wonder what the, uh, the whole thing with the armor is. Oh yeah, the final chorus, with the key change. I'm a sucker for key changes. Hmm. So he's broken out, and he's seeing how everyone else has been heartbroken, I guess. Ah, yes. This part's a little... intense. Pulls his own heart out of his chest. Yeah, okay. Alright, for our last song, this is a song that just came out, like, this week, and it's called Heart. Starting to notice a theme. Except the other song was in a more literal sense, this one is more like the heart as in like feelings. I have not heard this yet. I haven't seen it or anything. That I can, I can promise you that. 
right off the bat, lots of colors. Which is different from the previous music video. And we've got subtitles. Hmm. I'm recognizing these faces. I don't, like, I don't have their names down yet, but... I may soon. This garden sort of uh, setting is really... Oh. I was gonna say it looked really cool, but now they're out in the open. A very different setting, but still a very bright aesthetic. Oh, their time is good. Hm. I don't know what that means, but it's catchy. I do like this. I think the music video is definitely a highlight for me, because it's just, it's really, um, well done. <laughs> like, it's well shot and well edited. Wow. Their use of color is really cool. Have I said that? <laughs> I feel like I have. This is some interesting choreography too. I don't even know what I just saw, but it was cool. Ooh. The way they're harmonizing with each other is cool. If you've been following my channel for the last month or two, I've been doing streams pretty much weekly in which I record these videos. However, I feel like I record videos better when I'm not being streamed as I'm doing it, but I also don't want to give up streaming, so what I have thought of is every week we're gonna have themed streams based on whatever group I explored during the week. So this week it's a hundred percent. On Friday, 11.45 Eastern US time, I'm going to be live streaming a bunch of reactions to all their music, especially their B-sides. I'm gonna listen to entire albums and such. And then maybe at the end I'll take some non-100% requests, but it depends on turnout. So if that's something that would interest you, you can click the bell icon and you'll be notified when it starts. You can follow me on Twitter or join my Discord server if you want various other updates like when future streams will be, what I will be streaming, etc what videos I'll be making, any kind of information, and the Discord server's like, it's becoming a community at this point, so it's pretty cool. Links to both are in the description. Thank you for watching, I hope I'll see you soon, goodbye!